Good evening and welcome to the Whiskey Lover Society with me, Gert Tief. And today um, I am reviewing the Cardu 12 year old single malt um, Scotch whiskey bottled at uh, 40% ABV. So, um, this is a, a sample bottle, um, 20 centiliters um, from my local online store. Uh, I think I paid around um, 8 or 9 euro for a bottle. Um, the bottle will cost you about um, 36 euros uh, for a 70 centiliter bottle. So um, let's have a, a little bit of a, a, a nose test, taste test, and um, give it a little bit of a score. It is a quite light gold color, a um, little bit of uh, sunshine uh, in a glass, um, not very uh, oily, so let's give it a nose, quite pleasant um, um, smell to it. Light, um, forty percent ABV, so the, not uh, not a big uh, alcohol hit. Fruity, um, apples maybe uh, a little bit of an apple, a little bit of pears, um, light uh, summery fruit, a little bit of honey. Honey notes are definitely uh, there. It's quite sweet as well. A little bit of hint of oak, so I think uh, there is a little oaky dryness. <coughs> um, maybe a little bit of vanilla, um, but in the background it's, it's not, not much, like a little vanilla ice cream type of a creaminess to it. And um, with the cough, I, I think it was uh, a little bit of a, a peppery note as well. If we go into the taste. Sweet. Quite pleasant, actually. Um, I don't get any, any oak to it. There's um, no bitterness to it. A little spicy, spicy note for two, three seconds. A little bit of a, a burn, burny on, on the tongue. And then it just mellows off to a nice sweet, um, taste to it. I thought it's going to be a little bit more oak to this, but obviously um, I think they have a perfect balance, the sweetness, um, that, and I know I, I don't like the oakiness in some of the whiskies, and this for me, I get almost no, no oakiness. Now, after a while, I can feel it building up a little bit, but it is quite pleasant. On the third sip you get a little bit more of the oak. Still not unpleasant, quite drinkable actually. A little bit of a, a nutty note uh, to it as well. This is a surprisingly a, a nice whiskey. It is a budget whiskey, well, maybe a little bit more than a budget whiskey, but it is definitely um, uh, a drinkable whiskey. It's, it's something that um, it's, there's no unpleasantness to it. The fruit, light fruit flavors uh, for me is nice. It's not the overly sweet. Um, I do like sweet whiskey. 
but sometimes you need something that's not so overly sweet uh, like the dark sugars the brown sugars the, uh, they don't have that so it's sweet but it is not overly sweet it's not sickening sweet it is a quite a one tone nose to it but if you if you keep on going back um, to find something else I think you you're gonna you are eventually going to find something that uh, clicks the brain and says ah I've, I've smelled that before so quite pleasant um, quite su quite surprised I think that is something that I will definitely invest in the future again maybe get a full bottle A little vanilla, getting uh, getting more intense now, more vanilla notes. I would not suggest adding water to it. Maybe it's also something that uh, will be good in a cocktail uh, because of the uh, balance of all the different notes um, and not one thing that just stands out and jumps at you and scream, um, I, I'm vanilla or I am raisins and I take over everything. So yeah, it's quite pleasant. This is a, a, a nice surprise. <coughs> I bought two bottles actually, um, the one the Cardo, and I've got also going to try the next. I'm going to try the Johnny Walker, twelve year old, and compare the two to see um, which one I like the best. But that, of course, that's for the next video. Yeah, this is really a pleasant one. Um, I would recommend trying it. Um, if you are new to whiskey and you want to, to to begin the journey with all the different types of whiskies, I would definitely recommend you um, to get a sample bottle like this. Um, it is um, relatively cheap. Um, and it, of course, you can, with sample bottles, you don't have to spend the money uh, up front to, for something that you might not like in the end. So if you want to introduce your friends um, to whiskey, I think this is a good start. I, I know there's a lot of whiskies out there to start with, but I think this one is for me quite pleasant. And I, I really like the, the, the balanced flavors of everything. So hmm, now I get a little bit of butter. Um, you know, the real butter that you buy I get that little butter, buttery nut, the little pop, um, butter on popcorn. Yeah, the definitely um, buttered popcorn. And that, uh, well, that's quite pleasant. So, to give it a score, um, I will give it a quite a high score actually considering that the pleasantness of it so I will definitely give it a score about um, 82 out of 100 and um, and I will definitely recommend it for the beginner whiskey the drinker and to get a bottle or two so that you can share with your non whiskey drinking friends so that they can also experience that something that is mild mellow, uh, drinkable, and not going to chase them away uh, when you start introducing them to something a little bit uh, higher proof perhaps or uh, different flavors of whiskey. So, nice score. Please um, like and subscribe the video. And I will see you next time with the Johnny Walker 12-year-old. Thank you very much for watching and stay safe.